Now, earlier he showed, we looked at media loading. Let me show you how easy it is to work in media. And you notice, this page is out, but you can still print on an issue. Okay? Now, we showed ease lo media loading, and this was how you saw that he had to take out the tray. Now we show you tonal, tonal cartridge replacement. Remember earlier I said that the printer comes pre-installed? All in? Yeah. So you can imagine when I have to change my toner, one door I open and I just change. Less than one minute. You can imagine what? I just change, take out, change, and then close. Right? Simple. Okay? Now let's see what you need to do when you have to change the toner, right? The cartridge of this. Okay, so first, five steps, huh? For this X. Okay, remember, this is an output tray. Alright, sometimes I put things here, as many customers will do the same. I have to first take out the paper, step one, whatever is here. Open it up. Yeah? And this is a drum set. Yes, okay. Now, this one here is all in one. Drum and toner roll into one cartridge. This is a two part. This is a drum set, okay? Now, earlier I said that when you install, it's empty, you have to. This is step three, right? Power on, this is step three install. And so this is one of the two parts here. Yeah? Okay, it gets a little difficult. In fact, it's actually quite heavy too, right? So you need to be strong to do this. Can you help me in step one? Okay, it's a bit tough. So this is huge. Okay. Okay, fine. All right, and... Okay, are we closing? Okay. Now, the toner, where you see one door, remember I have to open this door and that door, right? When you see one door, I could change everything. Here I have to open one big door and this tiny door. Now this is the drum set. The drum set was earlier, this is a toner cartridge. It's separate, it comes as a two part, right? Now, it's only one door and you must change, you can only change one toner cartridge at a time. This one is one door or four, right? One at a time. I can't just simply yank it out, it doesn't work. It won't allow me to. It's got to be manual driven, okay? So let's try. Please wait. Okay, I'm still waiting. He still say, please wait. <coughs> Adjusting. Okay, that's a message I'm reading. Okay, ready to print. Okay, so I press the menu button. And I want to change toner, right? So I'm going to get to the message that says change toner. Meter reading, at new menu, replace toner. I got it after a few times. Earlier I had a longer time to doing it. Now I know maybe this button will help me. So instead of saying OK, I say eject. Okay. And it says so replace toner. It says cyan. If I want magenta, I move down, yellow, black. Okay, let me stop in magenta. So it says replace toner, magenta. So I say eject, okay? So what it's doing is, you hear the sound? So the four, the four toners like this. So it's moving magenta up to the top. And it says, please replace magenta toner. So I open up, so one, can you show me how to do that? Take out the old toner, right? Imagine putting back a new one, okay? Okay, close the door, okay? And it says, please wait, so I wait. Remember there are four toners. I need to do this four times, one at a time, because the door here can only allow me to do one at a time. Right? Now the SMB customer has no time. It's always it could multitask, yeah, I could do that, yeah. Okay. And it says please wait. So maybe I'll go and get my coffee while the toner is being changed, right? I changed magenta just now, right? Okay. And guess what? It says replace toner magenta. But then I just replace magenta. Why is it showing me the same message, right? So it's strange. So I'm wondering whether I should change again. So it doesn't really tell me clearly what I'm supposed to do. Okay, so assuming you want to change another one. Ah, okay, I press yellow. And then it says replace toner yellow. And the same thing will happen for every toner that I change four times. Remember the speed, less than one minute. This is like one toner at a time. One toner was more than a minute. Easily three, four minutes if you saw how it was. Okay? Okay, now this one here, same, what, two part, right, this is the toner, 
and I have to unlock the door, open another door, and this is the drum set. Okay? I'm gonna change. Now the thing about this is that before I change, I've got to go through one step that takes me four processes, or rather, or rather one step times four. Okay? I have to use this cleaning rod and I have to move it up and down two, three times. One, two, three, one for this set. Another one for the second one. And what it does is, this is from the user guide. Remember, we have to read the user guide yeah, for this one. It tells you to do that in order to maintain the print quality that the printer promised to deliver. Okay, two, three times, and two, three times, two, three times. All right, and then I can take it out and change my drum set. Okay, that's right. And then after that, I close. I can't close because I forgot to close this door. I still can't close because I forgot to lock it. Okay? So it's quite it's quite cumbersome. Right, this one here, one door opens everything, only four, only one part toner, and that's it. Simple. Alright? Easy to use. A little bit more complicated. Not so user friendly.